Hello everyone. Today we will talk about dispersion. How to calculate standard deviation, skewness, cortices, variance and the range of a sample in Excel. We have a data x and the values lie from A3 to A23. To calculate average, we use function equal average. And the range is A3 to A23. And answer is 10. To calculate median, we use function equal median. And select the range A3 to A23. And the answer is again 10. To calculate mod, we use equal mod function. And the range is A3 to A23. Answer is 10. When mean, median, mod are equal, we can see that distribution is normal. To calculate standard deviation, we use function equal standard deviation. It will give you the generation of a sample A3 to A23. And the deviation is here 5.63. To calculate skewness, we use equal skewness and again ranges A3 to A23. Answer is minus 0 0.098. To calculate cutosis, we use function equal cutosis. Range A3 to A23. Answer is minus 0.9955. To calculate sample variance, we use function equal variance of a sample A3 to A23. And answer is 31.7. To calculate the maximum value in the given sample, we use function equal max. Ranges A3 to A23. And the maximum value in the data is 19. We can check that. Yes, the maximum value is 19. And to calculate the minimum value, we know the minimum value is 1. But we will find out with the help of a function equal minimum. A3 to A23 and the answer is 1. To calculate the range of any sample, we say we use formula maximum minus minimum. So we use D14 minus D15 and the answer is 18. To calculate the sum of all values of a sample, we use function sum. The range of the data is A3 to A23. Answer is 210. To count item in a sample, we use function equal count. Range A3 to A23 of a given sample. And the number of items are 25. So with the help of this function, we can calculate average, median, mod, standard deviation, skewness, cutters, sample variance, maximum, minimum range, sum and the count. Hope it is helpful.